morning. Friday. We love talking about great things that are happening, no matter what aspect it involves. And today we're talking about a local film that's set to be shot. So we brought in the director of said project. Good morning and welcome to morning. Jack Meggers this Hi. morning. Thanks for being here. Thank you. Thanks for having me. Now this is kind of a perfect scenario, Brent Rasky, filmmaker. By the way, look at this. Look at this two shot right even here. Even kind of dressed alike. This morning got twins going on. I mean, we're playing our I role perfectly. I mean, you're perfectly. like a brother from another mother. So tell us about uh, your little bit of your background in this current project that you're getting ready to get going. Sure. Uh, I was uh, raised in Mason City, Iowa, originally. I went to Iowa State and studied performing arts there. Um, <laughs> then I moved to New York City. Uh, Spent seven years in New York, realized I wanted to make films, so I moved to Los Angeles where I've been living and working for the last seven years, working in film. Um, I got to a point where I wanted to make a feature film of my own after working for many years on other people's projects, so right. I conceived of this uh, idea to shoot and uh, set here in Iowa, so and now I'm back to uh, make all that happen. What made, besides growing up here, yeah. what made you want to come back to Iowa to shoot a film? I was really inspired by uh, sort of some of this, my growing up, um, and and to shoot a, a, a low budget, you know, uh, movie, you kind of have to shoot it in one location, and, and rather than shoot it in a house or an apartment in Los Angeles or something like that, I thought, well, maybe, why don't we shoot it in the woods, and, and that brought me back to sort of my childhood and going camping up, uh, mostly up in northeast Iowa in, mm -hmm. in the Yellow River Forest, and, and so I was inspired by that and and so I set the movie there and, and there's a clip we're gonna watch a little teaser yeah a little teaser trailer okay mm -hmm. let's take a look So as you can see, it's a romantic comedy. As you say, uh, <laughs> not a rom-com. I'm, I'm glad well. that you're highlighting in Iowa and all the beautiful scenery we have. Man, that's kind <laughs> yeah. of a scary. It, uh, it, it is. A, it's at. a supernatural thriller with some horror elements to it. So yeah, it's a little scary. Now she had a sickle. Is that is that based on the uh, on the serial killer we had here? The the one the chop at the house thing. I wasn't aware of that, but yeah, no. A little uh, while ago, but anyway. uh, so what? Uh, you had a, a short film at, at the Cannes Film Festival in the short film corner. Um, mm -hmm. I, I got to tell you, that was one of my favorite things to do, to show a short film there. What, what Did you enjoy going to Cannes? I, I didn't actually even go. I just, oh. yeah, I wasn't able to. I spent all the money on the on the film and the post-production process, so I wasn't actually able I to. I did the opposite. I made a very cheap film. So <laughs> <laughs> you could go to Cannes. Oh, my well, goodness. Well, that's, that's the key, right? From what little I know is, is you want to do these projects, but you have to find people to, to help out and back it. Is yeah, it easier no, nowadays true. with Kickstarter and GoFundMe and things like that? Well, you know, I mean... I believe so. I mean, Kickstarter is great, especially for in that, you know, when you're starting off uh, to make a short film and that sort of thing. The, the movie I'm making right now is actually, you know, it's a it's a proper business venture. Mm -hmm. I mean, film is, is uh, as you know, Brent, it's, it's, it's show business. So mm -hmm. I have, uh, we and my business partner, Chris Riken, who is a, an executive, a former executive from Castle Rock Productions in Los Angeles. Yeah. We have two Iowa-based LLCs where, you know, we're seeking investors for our movie. It's, it's a half a million dollar movie movie so this is sort of above and beyond that Kickstarter realm sure. um, yeah and you know you mentioned you know a half million dollar budget in Iowa is going to be basically a 1.2 1.3 million dollar budget correct. in California I mean that's going to go so much farther yeah every you know you're, you're you will find that every location here hasn't been burned 20 times shooting a movie yes. in Los Angeles they've all been we're they've never doing a shot. movie again yeah. I don't care how much they pay yeah. so here they're gonna love it and that's another reason why we're here too because yeah. we know that that money is going to go three times as, as far in Los Angeles we would have a lot of you know just a lot more issues a lot more things to pay for everything's more expensive there everything is everything is cheaper here and then as you can see from some of the clips in that uh, in that teaser it's we have production value like crazy it's beautiful sure. I was such a beautiful place to you know to shoot so uh, your script or finished script or it's my script yeah yep yeah. yeah. I wrote it a year and a half ago uh, in my dad's basement in uh, Lansing Iowa I thought you were saying I was out in the woods by no. myself for yeah. 10 days me and a laptop and a big battery no <laughs> <laughs> now, are you going back to Hollywood and campaigning about uh, people need to come here to shoot films? Like we were hot for a while, and because now of the tax and stuff. Yeah. yeah, the tax and some of things like that. Like yeah. people need to come back to Iowa. And shoot we're, you know, we're working on both coasts. My my producing partner is actually in. Uh, she's on the East Coast at the at the moment.
moment, but she's you know bouncing back and forth between Los Angeles, New York, and, and Iowa. And so we are we are promoting that, but you know we want we want our film to show that like hey, it's cool to shoot movies here. It's this is a great place to shoot. It's beautiful, and tax incentives are no. It's it's still a great place to shoot films. Well, we we filmed uh, according to Moyne here, and every single one of the cast, uh, Brandon Jones, who's on Pretty Little Liars, etc. They all looked in the local real estate about buying property here. Once they get here, they love it. Yeah, and especially, I mean, Des Moines is such an amazing town. A lot of people don't know about it on, on either coast, and, and, and the River Valley, Northeast Iowa, is just gorgeous. I mean, it's I'd it's amazing. So. Well, let's talk about your movie. It sounds like you have some good names coming in for this project as well. Well, we haven't landed any talent yet because okay. we're waiting until we have, you know, the majority of our budget to okay. go out to the stars. I think with our contacts in Hollywood, we, we should be able to land at least one bankable movie star, and that's kind of our, our plan is to be able to make it marketable worldwide so that we can make our money back for the investors and, and you oh, that's know. Nice, uh, that's nice key art you got there. So yeah. where are we at with this project and how can we follow, follow it along since it has some nice Iowa roots? Today? Yeah, we, we are going to shoot the film next summer. We're, we're at the stage right now where we're seeking investors and so we, we've got a little bit of uh, you know we've got some investors on board we're still we're still seeking investors uh, accredited investors and, and that's kind of where we're at with it right now you know we've got we'd like to raise the rest of the money before sort of next spring so what we have you know we have smooth sailing going into the pre-production process is there a website people can go to to kind of follow the progress of this project or not just quite yet uh, what we have we have the domains but we haven't set up our website yet we okay. do have a Twitter handle it's at the burial movie uh, and uh, we have a Facebook page so the burial movie is is our Facebook and, page and as what well. so so someone's watching the segment right now and they're like mm -hmm. where's my checkbook how do they yeah. get a hold of you? Through the Twitter? Through the Twitter is probably yeah. the best bet, yeah, to the Twitter. Uh, I think uh, at my website or my company's website, which is either jackmeggers.com or Wholehearted Productions, which is uh, our company, wholeheartedproductions.org. You, you should our contact information is up there. And so. to kind of go along with that, maybe you're a, an actor or an actress that would might be want to be a part yeah. of the movie. Is there opportunities for that in the future? There will be absolutely. We're going to be, you know, like we said, we're going to be casting, you know, some bankable talent from Los Angeles, but we're also going to be trying to fill in some of these roles with uh, Iowa talent as well. In the clip, there's a very talented uh, young comedian actually named Tom Garland, and he is from Cedar Rapids. And he's got some national prominence, and, and actually, he was an amazing joy to work with. So he's someone that I'm definitely considering for the role nice. in the future. So all right, so stay on top of Twitter, Facebook. A great thing happening here in Des Moines, and it's going to be keep going on to, into next year. Yep. All Thanks right. for having Thank me. Thank you guys. so much for coming in this morning. Thank you. More coming up on Great Day. We'll be right back.